Well, you were great in that pretend fight. Uh, what fight? <laughs> Hey everybody, Nostalgia Scott comes to you guys with part 3 of Spongebob Truth or Square. So in the last episode we beat Kelp Forest, so you have all the bronze happiness objects collected. We get 5 up. Woohoo! Wait, what? Oh yeah, the collectibles. Sync upgrade. Oh, I guess we'll talk to Patrick. Oh wait, before we do that, we do have enough to get the, um, health upgrade. I believe this is the final level to... Yeah, then we can buy another one. But anyways, let's talk to Patrick. Uh, thanks for trying to cheer me up, Patrick. But I still can't remember where I put the secret formula! Wait! How about the time we staged the fight to get you into the salty spittoon? That's a happy memory. Ah, yes, the salty spittoon. Who is Mermaid Man's arch enemy? SpongeBob. Technically, it's Man Ray, but I'm pretty sure after times went on, SpongeBob's become his uh, arch enemy. His comic book enemy is Man Ray. <laughs> This is cheering me up. Ah! Remember what I said? You're going down, Tubby. <laughs> um, Patrick, what happened to you, buddy? You became a machine. Please don't kill me. Oh yeah, I'm buffer than a sponge on roids. There you go, you lost your pants, buddy boy. Uh huh. Ice? What are you gonna do with ice? Oh no, enemies. Oh no, whatever shall I do? Oh yeah, you just knock. You, they don't take extra hits. And they just stop spinning the first time you hit them. If you use a spin attack on them. Oh. Now we got ice all over, which I think just makes everything slippery, obviously. Ow, I took double damage. Oh yeah, and then you can't do anything without the power-up, so we do need the power-up. Then we just gotta dip and dodge him 500 times in a row. Can we not? What is he doing? What was that? Your skibbies are showing. Butt smash! Butt smash! And there we go! Boom! Your butt has been smashed! Another sentence again in the third video that I don't think I'd ever want to say. At least we get a little bit of money in these levels. Oh, yeah. We got the big boys. Okay, we gotta wait for the big boy to stop his hammer attack though, so that way... Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Now it's jelly! That's a, that's a creepy robot, though. Like, not gonna lie. Woohoo! Come on, Mr. Pat Rick. And there we go! And we killed him! That was easy. great in that pretend fight. Uh, what fight? 
Yeah, <laughs> that's funny. And I do believe we get a happiness object. And we got the hot dog. Oh, from Winnie Hut Juniors. <laughs> Wait, why is it green? Ew, nasty. I can feel the happiness bubbling up. Stop! Oh, I think I might even remember where I put the formula. Well? Well, it could be. Yes? Maybe it's the... Um... Spit it out, you square brain twit! I mean, friend. I don't remember where it is yet. No, oh, maybe I really am a weenie. Mr. Krabs is gonna fire me twice. Don't worry, SpongeBob. We'll make you so happy you'll remember the Alamo. I smell jelly. You guys are the best friends a depressed sponge could ever have. Let's make me happy. Okay. Replay, uh, due to replace karate. Breathing. Uh, that's the episode where he breaks his butt. How a sponge broke its butt, I don't know. And how you break your butt in general, I don't know. None of that episode makes... It's like one of the weirdest Spongebob... It's a good episode, but it just really makes no sense. Also, why is this such a long, um... Little question... I think because it's like completely loading things again. So how you guys doing? You guys enjoying this Let's Play so far? I know I am. It's pretty fun. Uh, you guys voted for it. So I was like, you know what? Let's let's do this one. Squeezing things? He doesn't squeeze things. Um, also, thank you, jeez louise. Oh, we gotta talk to Mr. Crabbertron. Okay, Mr. Krabs. Jiggle me handle, Spongebob. Are you starting the party without me? Mr. Krabs, I have terrible news. How do I put this? Oh, I got it. Spongebob forgot where he put the Krabby Patty secret formula. So now we're trying to cheer him up to jog his memory. Okay. Don't worry, lad. We'll get your brain happy again. Surely you must remember the time I hired you as me fry cook. It's my life's work. Oh, yeah, this episode. I believe this actually takes place at Goolagoon. What does Patrick keep having mem uh, nightmares about? Spiders, because that's the one where, um, after the nematodes eat SpongeBob's house, he goes to sleep over there and he thinks he's a spider. And picks up his home and smashes him up. Yep, Gula Goon. Oh yeah, the cannon ability. And then we still have one more. No, this isn't Gula Goon. Fun fact. They never get the Mr. Krabs voice actor for any of these characters in the games, yet everybody else is the original. So I don't know. So yeah, you can you can Oh wait, no, you need ammo to use the cannon. Excuse me, but you seem to be in my hammer's way. Also, uh, since Oh. Oh god. I, I didn't know we can go in the sand there game. Thank you very much. It would have been nice to know that, but no. Oh yeah, those are the cannonballs, by the way, if you were wondering. I'm not a big fan of the cannon ability. Like, it's creative, I guess, and adds more gameplay to the game, but it's just something that I'm not a huge fan of. Yeah. Meat, meat, hungry, hungry, meat, 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 meat. I thought I already grabbed underwear. Oh no, I guess I got hit multiple times, so... So what you gotta do is you gotta stand on these, and then... Oh, I did not hit that, but okay. And then you feed the uh, the anchovies to progress with the level. Essentially, that's all you gotta do. And then this guy is pulling them on a surfboard, I guess? I don't know. Makes no sense, but I'll take it, I guess. And now we can get up on top of here. Now this is where the level gets annoying, because now you have like hazards up here and everything and then you can also get pushed off with these blocks 
And it's just ridiculous. I completely missed that. Also, the camera angle's broken again. I can't see anything. Gotta love when the game does that, right? Oof. Anyways, we made it. The Pogo Plunger Bot? Fire! You're dead. And then you gotta do this again. Fire! There we go. We fed another one. Gulp. Oh, the gray one's been fed. We still need to feed the green one. But I did see something over here. Uh, what side do I need to... Whoa! Oh, you know, we need to go over there. Alright, these guys take one hit to kill, so at least that's good. So hoping that they weren't going to be too strong. I don't know if I could hug a jellyfish, but sure... Wait a minute, all this for a 1-up? You could potentially die, and they give you... the game's got to stop doing that. You know, because it's just ridiculous. And then you got to deflect them, so you got to aim at things like so, and then just watch it bounce, and boom, done. And then we can progress again. I really despise this level, though. This is, like, my least favorite level in any of the Spongebob games I've played. I haven't played Cosmic Shake yet. I'm probably going to get that sometime in April, hopefully. Especially if it goes on sale. And then I'll Let's Play it as a sequel to this. Be, like, the one new game that we actually do. Or newer game that we do. Okay, we got another one-up right here. Wait, can I maybe, like... No? How am I supposed to get that? That seems way too risky. I know that you can double jump, but still. Seems a little risque without the, the risque part, you know? Oof. Oof. I don't feel like I want to break those. Thank you very much, game. Uh-oh. Oh, I think we were supposed to uh, move ahead of that one. Ow. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. Game. It knocked me off. And then didn't let me get back on. That's fun, I guess. Oh, at least we're getting closer to our next health upgrade, since it seems to stay the exact same price. I think the issue with this level that I don't like is the camera angle. Wait, I can't make that, regardless of how I run through. Alright, if we just stay perfectly still, we should be fine right here, right? Uh-oh. Alright. We made it to the next section, and wow. I think this is just Jellyfish Fields again. Now what do we got? Oh, it's just showing us the lay of the land. Okay. Where's Mr. Krabs this time? Oh. He is one of the better sounding um, Mr. Krabs voices, though. Wow, these guys actually take a lot more to kill. Holy cow. Ugh. There we go, we only have two left, so that's super good, I guess. I love how, like, your cannon shots are literally just water balloons. <laughs> and that's all the robots down. What did that unlock? And unlock the muscular power up. Oh, I see. We need it to break things around the area. Uh, I see what the game wants us to do. Yeah, we know. It's not your pants that are ripped, dude. It's you. Because you're so hunky, Mr. Sponge. Everyone loves a hunky man sponge. Alright. Let's aim down sights. Go! Boom. And there we go. One of three anchovies fed. Num num num. Back in your hole you go, buddy. One thing I'll admit is the music in this game is 
pretty darn good. Then again, all I have to do is go up like kind of like the regular Spongebob themes and then go off of that. Fire! And that's an easy one, that's literally just a straight line, but thanks. Well, I guess they are set to which one it is, because the easiest one's always the one in the middle. Uh, and we need to destroy these. And then get those to pop up. And... I want those all, I want those coins to all spawn in, so to do that, wait, boom. Wait, what? Why didn't that one go off of that one? Weird. That time it did. That was confusing. But whatever. Vault. Oh, and that unlocks the cave. So we don't have to take the stupid C bus anymore. And we need some more cannons. I don't really find the cannon to be that useful of an, uh, like, a uh, an attack. Easy come, easy go. Wait, does that remove my other power-up? That's annoying. Hello, Mr. Robot. Oh. oh, now we got our buff ability again. Oh yeah, these guys are shy. I don't like that about the cannon guys, though. The, the fact that they'll run away from you. Patrick, are you in any of these by chance? Oh, you didn't even... Ooh. There we go, that was perfectly timed. There's lots of, like, breakables in here, though. Holy cow. There's, like, treasure trove up in here. <laughs> Alright, what do we got going on over here now? Oh, challenge, that's nice to know. No, no, it's not kinda neat. Oh, we sink! Okay. Nothing special there. And Oh, and we get the next power-up. All in the same level. You've got to beat all these ravenous scallywags and send them on their way. That's so cool. This is kind of Soaking it up. Wow, I'm Derpy Bob. Look at me, bruh. So yeah, you press Y to fire. And you can break those if you squirt on them. And there we go. And empty your pores by pressing B. Kind of makes sense, though, because we're a sponge, right? Now, this part, I actually had glitch and then caused me death. Yeah, I get it, you're hungry. Meep, 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 meep. Hungry, 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 meep, meep, meep. Can you stop saying meep meep hungry in the background, please? Like, sir, I don't I don't appreciate you. They're, they're never gonna stop, are they? They're always hungry. There we go. Double. Oh yeah, don't don't touch that sand. Like, a lot of time you get stuck in it and then you'll Then you'll die. Like, I've had the game here glitch really bad. Alright. Let's just keep breaking all these Mrs. Puff things. Don't know why it's Mrs. Puff. I get because they swell up and explode like she does, but... Doesn't it seem kind of mean? Or if we have enough to destroy this one? Ooh, just enough. Now we can go around and collect the rest of this stuff that's just around here. Why is it kind of neat, Spongebob? We're just destroying boxes. That's all we're doing. Hey, Patrick! Patrick was easy to find, compared to the last few levels. That's for sure. How come I didn't destroy the one that was, like, right next to it? Yeah, you're so funny, Spongebob. That was also really delayed. Turn around, man. Why would you have something to, something cold to drink in his head? Yeah, that makes no sense there, uh... Please hold it, Plankton. Please! 
Why do you keep turning around that way, SpongeBob? Why well, can't you do me a favor? Whatever your little heart desires, my big friend. There we go. Great. Could you scratch my front of lobe? Happiness is as happiness dies. All right. What do we got going on over here? Anything? Looks like we got some one-ups and stuff over here. Oh, yeah, well, we can hit this one, that's for sure. So, we'll aim right here. Ping, ping, pong. And there we go. That's one of the three done. Oh, that was the second one, it seems. And I believe this is the last one, so... Now, I forget how we're supposed to deal with the Mr. Krabs ones. I think... Oh, they're bombs. Oh, we messed that up. I don't know why the Mr. Krabs ones are bombs, but sure. Oh, this one's easy enough. Fire in the hole. Wait, that wasn't even the first one, really? Oh yeah, and this one you gotta raise up, which is what you need the water for. And that's also how I got glitched in the game and kind of got stuck, so that's another issue. So, king it up. Why does he fart? And here we go. Man, it takes like half your water supply. Alright. Let's do this. Get me some more cannonballs. Step on this. And fire! Right down the center. And there he goes. All right, now... I think that's what this platform's for. Yes, it is. Um... That's it? There's nothing else up here? Okay. I'd rather be jelly fishing. Hey, that'll make a good bumper sticker. Uh, go! Oh, nine robots? Okay. Oh wait, those aren't... Those aren't cannonballs. Did I kill him? I did, without even meaning to. Wow, look at that. Nice. No, this is Goo Lagoon. I wasn't going crazy, this is Goo Lagoon. At least in Battle for Bikini Bottom, Goo Lagoon actually makes sense to now. To why it's called Goo Lagoon. Oh yeah, these guys. I think they recommend you use the uh, the cannon on them, but I don't I don't think so. And there we go. And that's one of these spin pads. But I'm pretty sure Goo Lagoon and Jellyfish Fields are, like, right next to each other. Like, in the, uh, show. Wait, did that get... Wait, what is this power-up? Oh. Go soothe their brains out? Wow. Wow, this is such a good power-up. Amazing. <laughs> I never really understood that power-up, honestly. It's kind of like the worst one in the entire game. Oh, maybe there is more to this level. Maybe this level's a lot longer than I remember it being. Because we're 24 minutes in, so... Oh, never mind. I don't think it is that much more. I thought that was another... Oh, that... I think that's Bikini Bottom in the background. Oh, yeah, this part. Oh, yeah, this is the part that starts to sink. I don't know how we didn't take damage from that, but sure. 
I have something tickling my arm right now, and it's kind of annoying. Oh, never mind. There were still more ravenous buttheads. Wait, there's like really nothing special here. This is just like really generic. Okay, I'll take really generic stuff for 500 Alex. Happy happens. Oh, I get it. They're rotating platforms now. Oh, and boom. Problem solved. Super easy. Well, mm, delicious SpongeBob. You don't want to know what the secret formula recipe is there, Mr. Fishman. Fire! Easy. And we made it to the bargain mart. At least that's what it looks like. Oh. Here on. And there he swims to the distance. Oh, is that what I think it is? Is that our spatula? Oh my god, it is! Spatula power! Gay Pride Rainbow, go! And the golden spatula. Oh, never mind. Mr. Squidward, you're on the register now. Oh, Mr. Krabs, I can't tell you what this means to a spud like me. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Easy, lad. One more outburst like that and you're fired. Uh, yeah, sure. What I don't get, though, is why we went to the bargain mart. Like, I get that it's in the uh, show. Uh, the karate. Um, but... Like, that's not where he gets hired. He comes in, saves the day, and then Mis Mr. Krabs hires him, so I don't know. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video, please remember to leave a like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell for notifications, join the Discord and Patreons in the link below, and I'll see you guys all next time. Have a wonderful day, and bye bye